Music producer Quincy Jones has 22 girlfriends? 22! I don't understand. I mean, I don't, I can, he has money, he's Quincy Jones, but 22 girlfriends all over the world? Oh, and they all know about each other. That's the funny <laughs> right, part. And right. he's 84 years old and he refuses to date women his own age. <laughs> wow. Uh, we had a superstar in our neck of the woods, Channing Tatum uh, in Roseville. We had no idea. I'm so way. mad. Mm -hmm. We did not know Channing Tatum was in Roseville. Come on! Oh my gosh, Ashley is all about it. <laughs> Channing Tatum uh, from Kingsman, the Golden Circle. Uh, he was doing that. Uh, he's promoting his uh, products over at Top Golf and did a swing thing. Yes, mm -hmm. I'm so mad that I missed this. I just want to know if he did any of his Magic Mike moves. You know, know. So, mm -hmm. about five years ago, he released his own version of Rudolph the Red Nosed Reindeer, yeah. and it went viral. So here we are. He finally released a cover of the track in true DMX fashion. Oh my gosh. The, the whole thing. Would you buy my sled tonight? He was going. <laughs> Oh, DMX style. It is just fantastic. I, I love this. Song. I love it. Looking at Kylie Jenner. Yeah, well, Kylie, no, she hasn't really confirmed if she's pregnant or not. Everyone's been saying so, but then sources say that she did go into labor mm. last week, Friday, and three days later, all of a sudden, hmm. Kim and Kanye's baby was here. Yeah. So we're thinking, or most people are thinking, that. You they, might be the same baby. Adoption. <laughs> yeah. They may have adopted Kylie's baby and just called it a day. Yeah. Well, Crazy. So where's Kylie's baby? Yeah. Well, I guess <laughs> nobody knows. That's the thing. Oh, like, real. He tweeted, they stole my toilet. Oh. Can you imagine? <laughs> Who steals a toilet? <laughs> right out the house. Just boom. He took a picture of it and then showed that the empty space where the toilet was and did the hashtag, find my toilet, please. <laughs> and there's even a Twitter account, stolen a toilet. <laughs> that responded, Charlie, are you looking for me? Oh, God, he already has a Twitter <laughs> account. Oh. So now the music community is stepping up. Yeah, they're going to wear a white rose. And so that, you know, it symbolizes uh, hope, peace, and sympathy and resistance. So now we can see them on Sunday with their beautiful white roses. And it's going to be amazing. Like, they're still trying to get this message across about sexual harassment and the Time's Up movement. So I love it.